Hello, monsters about here, and welcome I back. To return to my forge. Okay. To, to Warhammer 3. And part 6 of my Patreon supporter campaign with Zhao Ming, who apparently can't shut up. Fire and metal. That's what you find at Forge, yes. Last time, uh, we started to try and clean up Meow Meow's mess. What a mess it was. And we also had a poll, which was, should we confederate the land of the cat boys? For better or worse, our fortunes are intertwined. Well, apparently so, because... Uh, For the dragon. We're, we're taking them. We're taking them on. Okay, now what we're going to do here, what the, what's the public... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Ooh, no. Ooh, no. Yes. Speed, unity, and you're out of here. Get the fuck out. Okay, four is better. But we get negative from the confederation, so... This is fine. What do we we got right? We got four yang. So we need some we need some yin. Yin? Yin, yin. We need some we need some right, so if we do that and we change to that and we do you and you. Ba 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 da ba da Now I you know what? I don't think we need defenses here. I'm gonna be mm, do we? Mm. Okay, let's knock that down because we don't need that. Right, I, what I need... This is... fine -ish. This is... Okay. Right, what do we have here? More research rate. Do we have any... Do we have control? Less corrupt... What do, we, do we have any corruption here? We don't have any corruption here, we're doing... No, we don't have any corruption here. Okay, that's fine. Um... Right. Let's get more control, because we're going to need it. We can't do control there, which is a problem. We can't do anything here either. But, once we get this under control, we should then, if I can build another building there quickly, we should then be able to sort of like balance, get, get it in balance. And once it's all in balance, everyone will be fine. It'll be fine. Uh, right, what I want, right, okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to move you down, because we're going to kill the orcs. I'm going to bop the orcs, get them out of there, because if we can kill them, then uh, we, we, we should be fine. We should be fine. The cat boys. And temple of the elemental weebs. Perfect. Okay, good. Right. Uh, so, uh, no. Indeed. Praise be now. I'm gonna check the, the old the old picture on name suggestions, see if there's anything there. Gun who the hypercapitalist. I did I did rename Gun so we've got uh oh there's gonna be a little bit of friction. A little bit of friction there, because we've got Gun Ho, the hypercapitalist caravan, and then we've got you, the anti-capitalist. Should they ever meet? Or oh, like matter meeting antimatter. And we all know what happens then. Maybe. I I don't actually I don't I, that'd be bad? Explosion or is that okay? It's like ooze. It's like goo. I don't know. It's probably not important. I don't need that. So screw you. Perfect. Right. We need to retake Snake Gate. We need to retake Snake Gate. And uh, no. And in fact, all the gates have now fallen. So. <laughs> Yeah, good. Oh, were we going to lose that? Do I care? Earn the Emperor's boundless love. Holy shit, did you actually win? Did, wait, did you win? I destroyed. Yang is in Ascendant by four. Good. Did someone speak? Uh, holy shit, we did win. Holy balls. Wait. But we have more Chaos Boys, so let us go and beat up the Chaos Boys. Got the perfect. Oh, you know what? What? Hang on. Because I can merge ancillaries, can't I? Do I need those? Probably not. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Never mind. Did we get this? Okay, I want you to have that, don't I? Is that right? Is that what we had before? F fuck knows. Did, right, what if right, what have you got? Campaign movement range, good. Gift of chaos, concerning. Um that is less corruption, which is probably good for Oh, right, let's get rid of the jade. Let's put that one in there. 
Yeah, that's that's better. And then we can fuse. That's it. Make them kiss. And we'll get a. S s s s yep, that one. Legendary sword of an undead mercenary. Oh, there we go. Has a breath ability. Hmm. Okay, well, let's fuse those two. We get the bad moon banner. Yep, this is fine. <laughs> <laughs> this is absolutely fine. Absolutely fine. Uh, I'm going to fuse those. Yes. A laminate shield. Oh, that's... That is not the worst thing. You, what do you have? You've got that now. I could give you the ar I could give you that armor, but... Yeah. I'm going to fuse those two as well. An enthr th enthralling musk. That's a mood. You, the anti-capitalist, has an enthralling musk. Well, there we go. Holy shit. Get out of my mind. Didn't see that on my Xiaoming bingo campaign cards. Uh, right, let's go chain lightning. Sure. And let's go and... Bop these boys because they're getting all up in my in my shit. Banner of the Lost Holes. I mean, that's it's an area effect. So if we pop that on like you, then with any luck, you'll be in the middle of the line and you'll give bonuses to everyone. I'm fairly sure that a lot of your army are just flesh. Just pointing that out. Well, good luck with that. I'm going to need it. Because, you know, artillery and shit. Ooh. Cannonball to the chops. It's got a stink. Especially when you're wading through fields. I should get some more rockets. They're great. I do like the cannonballs, though. Big fan of big flaming balls. What can I say? So I'm sending Xiaoming to go and say hello to the Norskans, get their attention. And the mammoth on top of that. Let's keep back our forces there. Got some flankers. So we're going to reposition some of our troops. A cannon trying to pick them off, but we've got Mini Tau! Backed up by some Jade Warriors and Crossbows. It's looking good so far. Drop in a little final transmutation on those trolls, which is going to cause them some major issues. Yep. Taking a lot of damage there, and then Mini Tau can obviously charge them if need be. Although, to be honest, I think that might be surplus requirements. I think they might be. Yep, yeah, I think they're gone. They, they are gone. Jamming getting all attention in the centre there. We've got more trolls from the flankers on the left. And we've got Leo the Space Nerds. In his compass. Which is fine, I think. The Great Longmire Riders charging down into the into the trolls. They're getting a little bit of assistance there by the Jade Warriors are also moving in to assist. And those trolls unsupported and with no melee attack are going to not be too happy with that. Xiao Ming in the centre, just tanking a lot of Norskans. Keeping their attention, and of course that means they're getting shot to pieces. The enemy general is losing his army very rapidly. Yeah, he doesn't, he doesn't quite know what to do about it. He's going to attack Xiao Ming. But then thinks better of it and flees the battlefield with what's left of his army. There's not much. Alright, well that's one less army to worry about. Now I need to take Snake Gates. But, to do that, I don't want to use Xiaoming, because that will 
fuck his army. And I do not need his army fucked. So. Ooh, shenanigans. Okay, we've got a little army over there. Which should be fine. I'm not actually at war with you, which is good. So, what I'm going to do is we're going to recruit another boy. Doesn't matter who, as long as he is he or she. Oh, it doesn't really matter who's cheaper. You guys are cheaper, aren't you? So, if we get you, this moment has been prepared. that makes that slightly better. And then we can send him to go and repair Snake Gate. And once he's Let's repaired go. State Gate by himself, which will cost more money, but means that we can then disband him. And, uh, no worries. All good. What make you unyielding? Yeah. And then we'll go rally. An extension of my celestial will. Good. Love a bit of celestial will. I mean, I like celest... Mm. I mean, that could be useful. That could be useful to have. Right, public order here is not good. It's not great. So we've got those in one turn. At what point we'll be unbalanced again, but when aren't we? But then we'll get rid of the other guy. And I can't remember. Ooh, medicinal herbs. I love a bit of medicinal herbs. Uh, all right, I'm going to leave that for a minute. I'm tempted to do this to get more money. Oh, you know what? More control, actually. Fuck it. I might do this. Because you're going to be... If I leave, you're going to be sad, aren't you? Eleven. Oh, yeah, that's... 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 That's, that's, that's a rebellion. That's a rebellion just waiting to happen. I could crush it. That would make more money. And I mean, if you're sad anyway, you may as well be really fucking sad. Let's let's remove all of the... The in influences that are bad. The bad influences. Let's get rid of all the ne'er-do-wells. He Kang, what was I going to do with you? Genuinely can't remember. Was I going to send you to use army? Was that what I was going to do? Did I have a plan for you? I don't know. Perhaps we can forge a new path to get. Hmm, it seems unlikely. Uh, how does? Oh, you don't mind? Well, you don't like him. Ah, well, say no. We'll say no to you. Want to keep Gold Tooth on side? Ah, oh, god damn it, guys. Kind of like we should. Oh, lead belchers. Uh, how much cargo? Two hundred. Oh, pay up. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, Warpstone Desert is going to rebel. That's fine. We can squish it. That's going to rebel. That's fine. I don't really care. The Lord Magistrate stands ready. Okay. My orchestrations. I did. But your mom. All right. We're going to cover your advance, Chow Teng. As you go to rebuild the wall by yourself, that's going to rebel. That's fine. You're actually pretty happy, which is good. You're sad boys. That's fine. And you're sad boys. Well, not that sad. Is this place? This is the place going to rebel, isn't it? Do I care? To be honest, that will get rid of one of those, won't it? This is probably okay. A little bit of rebellion never hurt anyone. Unless you've got a giant army sitting outside the settlement you're about to rebel in. In which case, things are not going to go particularly well for you. Oh, look. It's Vermin. The Lord of the Jade Swan. Hello. Military alike. Uh, now, no, you do not get on with Goldtooth. And, oh, my God. Was that Kugath down there? What the fuck is this? Hang on. D what, what, actually, you know what? What are my victory conditions? Destroy Clan Eshin. Okay. Uh, control the following... Right, that's fine. Ensure the following... But Is that it? Oh, well, that's fairly straightforward. 
Okay, we were spotted. That's not a big deal. It's only going to cost 250 to colonize. There we go. And we can repair that. Do I care about Little Rebellion? Uh, I guess I kind of do. And until this is repaired, we have no garrison. So I'm just going to have to... I'm just going to have to chill here. Let us chill here momentarily. Right, we're going to go murder you. Not you, but... Him. They will earn their lives. The dragon blood. And if you if you oh if you go to rebel again, the beatings will continue. If you know what I mean. I yearn to return to my forge. Oh shit. Oh shit. Alright, you're gonna be finished in one turn, but it's gonna take a little while to get that settlement up to scratch. Leo is gonna be immortal. Good for him. Right, if we can get this under control, we should be okay. And the compass... Currently zero... Okay, it's not... I mean, it's not that much... Control, is it? Really? Four, plus four control is like... I don't know. It's alright. It's nice. It's good to have, I guess. You're going to... If I... Untax you... Doesn't really make much of a difference, so... How long do we have that confederation? Minus two. Two turns. So you're still sad. You'll be a little bit sad for a... Well, you're not... I mean, it's going to take ten turns for you to rebel. So actually, that's fine. We can go down and finish off the orcs. We just... I, I need you up here, ideally. That, that would be the win. Uh, more growth. That would be very useful, I think. More growth for Snake Gates. Yes. Grow my snake. Catherine! Hi there. Trade agreement. Yeah! Yeah, absolutely, my dear. Thank you very much. Could use it. Got some... I uh, don't, know, don't know if you noticed. Got some issues. Okay, more public order. Good. Another brick in the wall. That, that is, yes. Another brick in the wall would be nice. Uh, more more growth, all provinces, casualty, defensive stuff. We could get a little bit of recruitment there, but to be honest, I am... So what does this give us? Okay, it gives us a nice big garrison, but... The sooner we grow, the better. Upkeep for local armies is is quite nice. I don't what so ninety percent casualties suffered from chaos attrition. What is that in the that province? Because if so, that's not that useful. It doesn't say faction wide. Growth. We need the growth. Minus 100. Zinch corruption is minus 200 growth. Yeesh. Okay, well, we need to... I mean, it's, it's dropping very rapidly. No. It is. Trust me. The ninth wall is fine. We've got pots, which is good. Uh, how we do it? Right, now we can get rid of you, can't we? The Lord Magistrate You're fired. Which means we now have two yin. So <laughs> I can probably don't need defenses here, do we? I can probably get away without it. So let's build one of those. And that'll put us at minus one. Ok, 
Okay, that's now going plus four for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, is it He Kang? What do you do? You're a bureaucrat. Plus four. Okay, actually, that, that is not the worst thing to have right now. So you stay here and keep them happy. This place is pretty chill. We can get another one of you. That will then give us enough balance. And then hopefully we can sort of get control of the gates. Because that's what we need to do. We need to get control of the gates. Grow them. Anything that's going to give us growth would be super useful. Income from ports is legitimately useless. Construction time is fine. More range is okay. Upkeep reduction would be good. Uh, let's get improved winches. So in four turns, I'm going to need another Yan, but we'll worry about that mm, in a minute. I'm, I'm sorry, did you have a minute? Did you have a moment? Had a stroke? Stop your toe? What happened there? What the hell happened there? How do you intend to assist them? How do a more trade? Yes, please. I'm glad you're ready. I don't know who you are. Right, we've managed to get that big chunk of income. Just go. Plus, we've got we've got the Von Karstein blade. Look at that frenzy regeneration. Holy shit, that's really nice. The curious host of Castle Drakenhof awards your caravan master with a parting gift. A little bit of vampire corruption, but uh, what's a little bit of vampire corruption between friends? We can get the Mark of Zinch and the Alchemist's Mask. Perfect. Right. You. We're not currently at war with York, so we can keep an eye on what they're up to. What do they have? Do they have a snack there? Not much of one. A little art. We can, we can take that. We can take them. And oh my giddy aunt. Fuck it. What the fuck? Are you at war? No, you're not at war with Kugath. The fuck? Zinch, is this your doing? Are you doing shenanigans, Zinch? Stop doing shenanigans. I don't like it. Who the fuck is Nurgle at war with? Uh, the Dark Land Orcs. That makes sense. They're down there. Us, Loose Tooth, the Blue Vipers, and the Ice Court. Good. Okay. Okay, okay. Well, you know, we might have to clean this out a little bit. Evidently, there's some, some ooze over there. So we need, to, we need to bop that. Let us build the province capital. We will sit in here. So I've got minus 37. So that, that's slightly better. <laughs> it's slightly it's it's getting a little bit better but we are going to oh fuck uh right we do have defenses everywhere so that is something right we're going to have to hit the orcs and run you back i'm tempted to send you but the problem is if we leave snake gate it leaves it open to attack uh oh, it might be all right do we just go for it? Fuck it. I'm gonna to, we're going to have to go for it. Come here, little shit. You want to fight? Come fight me. Come and fight me. Uh, oh, we got caravan dispatch. Why have I got so many fucking caravans? Who are you guys? Hang on. Oh, is it because I confederated? You're dragon-blooded, so you've got celestial dragon boys. Okay, I mean, that seems fine. Plus, you are level 5. So you, I am going to... Can I disband you? Is there any way I can actually disband caravans? They actually cost me anything. I don't think they do, so there's no real reason to worry about it, I guess. Um, so, we increase that, and I'm going to tell you to go to... I don't know, here. Yeah, off you go.
Okay, we're perfectly balanced, but in three turns, we're going to have a, a little bit of unbalance. So I need another building or something. Um, oh! Certainly. Oh, the Celestial Lawyers have bloody taken the gates. They're, they're doing Meow Meow's duties for her. Harmony above all. Okay, everyone else... I mean, Meow Meow is like very... Does not want to confederate. Despite the fact that, you know, she probably should confederate. I yearn to return to my forge. You keep saying that, but we're not going back. We've got other things to be doing. No rest for the wicked. Okay, uh, non-aggression. I mean, it's, right, so this is something I've been thinking about in Warhammer 3. That, oh, you are attacking me. Good. We'll, we'll talk about it in the battle. I'll, I'll try to remember. I love the smell of rockets in the morning. Or whatever time of day this is. Afternoon? It's a nice smell anyway. So Norsegans are already taking that absolute... I think they're waiting for their reinforcements. Um, but considering they're waiting for one guy to turn up, can't help but feel that uh, sitting there and getting blatted with artillery may, may be not the best strategic choice. Um... Yeah, not not great. I'll level with you. Oh, especially if they're like bunching up around this house and uh, getting wrecked with cannonballs. More cannonballs, please. Yes, please. Cannonballs. Thank you. That's the stuff. Yeah, that did it for me. Good. I hope these people don't want to keep their houses. They look a bit muddy anyway. To be honest, they should probably move. I'm just giving them the impetus they need. Raining rockets down on their heads. That doesn't make them want to move. I mean, that, that is going to ruin the local area. Xiao Ming tanking that mammoth. And it's getting shot up the, up the jack sea with cannonballs. That's obviously going to make it a little bit sad. The uh, enemy reinforcements have finally turned up. But he's, he's, it's like that that gif with the guy that comes in uh, with pizza and then everything's on fire. It's basically it's basically him because everything is on fire. And uh, a lot of people are dead, actually. The right flank of the Norsegan army has literally disintegrated. It doesn't exist anymore. And that means we can now concentrate on the other side. So we're going to send in some celestial ancestors. To basically get the enemy's attention so we can shoot them more rockets. That that's what ancestors are for, right? Oh, hallowed ancestor, please. Please will you protect me on the battlefield by keeping my opponent busy so I can shoot rockets at their face. Is that is that how that works? Asking for a friend. Oh well, the enemy general is uh, taking on Xiao Ming. It's obviously a really bad idea. Xiao Ming is, uh, is an absolute beast. Um, but he, we did just shoot him with a cannonball, so... <laughs> He's like, ow. <laughs> That's it. Do some kicks. Do some flips. Do some parkour. You'll love it. He's, he's fine. He's alright. Cannonball to the face, doesn't that? Hurt him? No losses. Crushed it. Test subjects. Uh, oh, it says heroic victory, so... I guess that's... God, this this little town. The little town that could. Holy shit. The Blade of Lurglitch, that's fine. Uh, I'll be absolutely... No worries. Right, we've killed them. They're all dead. The threat has been reduced. That's good. Once it reaches high... Okay, so we've got a little while before we have to worry about that. Broken Hearts. Comes an earth-shattering wail from beneath the Dragon River, where it is said the spirit dragon slumbers, guarding Cathay's ancestors. While the Emperor makes no pronouncement, the import is clear. His long, unseen daughter mourns to see the families of the homeland so divided. Reverent minds act accordingly. The Iron Dragon. Um, 
it, wait, you're a caravan and you're rebels. How does that work? Can I just kill you? Yeah, apparently so. Okay, well, good. The little town that could survives another day. Okay. We don't have public order here. That's good. It is starting to grow. That is also good. We have plus three growth, which is... I mean, it, it could be better. It could be better, but... There we go. It, it, it is what it is. What weapon have you got? The Griffin Legion Lance. Uh, more charge bonus for cavalry. Yeah. Uh, oh, you know what? You could have. Uh, you could have. Hang on. Unless we just fucking merge it. Fuck it. Yeah. The refashioned dreaming cloak. What does this do? Snipe. Okay. Upkeep reduction for all units in the army. Very nice. And summons unit way watchers. Sure. Why not? <laughs> Absolutely. Fucking why not? <sighs> Star Iron Ring. Uh, uh, well, tell you what, let's, let's fuse these two together. Uh, Alchemist's Mask. I, I do like... like I, I realise this might be considered somewhat broken, but I, I do like the fun of fusing things together and seeing what we get. Uh, I'm going to fuse those two together. Blessed Blade of Petra. Sure. Sure, why not? I like it. I like it. Right. Let's go and uh, kill some orcs. Ah, uh, you know what? I, ah, sure, why not? Yeah, me too. I also... Valiant defeat. Really? I think we'll be fine. The Shroud of Dripping Death. Uh, sure. Put it on the... Uh, no, actually... Actually, you have you you get it. Yeah, good. Okay. Okay, we're gonna wait for the enemy reinforcements who have turned up, and then we're gonna take them out. So basically, we've got the enemy city in this direction. We've got some of the forces facing it, mostly the cannons who are taking some pot shots there. Meanwhile, over on this side, we are using the halberdiers basically to hold back the savage orcs and also blast them from the flank with the iron hail gunners, plus a little orby thing, which is going to bounce off this wall and then kind of clip that orc and then also fly directly into my iron hail gunners, which I didn't really expect to happen but there we go it did some damage but didn't actually kill any so that's um that's good so the orcs are doing some damage here but they're getting really shot to pieces from the rear plus you the anti-capitalist coming in from behind with the blessed blade of petra which of course is blinding the enemies making their melee attack and defense less good this means they are oh it's, it's it, is, it is very blindy to be fair that's a, that's a big blindy it's big and blindy. Okay, the Savage Orcs taking another flock of doom there. They are now retreating and getting shot to pieces as they retreat. Those Iron Hell Gunners just ripping through them. Getting some really good, really good damage in them there and uh, forcing them to retreat as reinforcements are gone. from Umuk Gork's Chosen, who is coming back. So we're going to send you to intercept. I don't I, I don't know what his plan is, but it seems like he's just kind of ignoring the fact that he's he's being attacked. Lots of Savage Orc bodies there. Now we just need to finish off the rest of them. There is quite a few. Uh, there are... Yeah, yeah I mean, that we, we do outnumber them, so that's something. The cannonballs tearing through some of those Savage Orcs. Good shots there. So we need to push forwards. Got the iron. Nope, the crane gunners. That's the one. Crane gunners. 
Taking some pot shots. Done a little bit of damage. It's not too bad. They're doing all right. Don't shoot until you see the whites of their eyes. They've got red eyes, but you know what I mean. Okay, we're moving our forces, redeploying them up towards the city. My plan is we're going to push in through the south here, take this supply location. And then try and use this as like a holding plate. And then we're going to push out, basically. We're going to try and take... They do a couple of towers here. I don't know, like... Do... Hmm, do the other factions have proper towers yet? Or do they just have, like, you know, default towers? Like, do orcs have, I don't know, Doom Diver towers, for example? Genuinely don't know. Okay, moving our boys up, taking a little bit of fire... But it's orcs, so it is not going to be the most accurate of missile fire. Doesn't this look nice? It's a little bit here. I'm fairly sure this water's flowing uphill, but... Uh, I mean, you know, to be fair, we've got big floating rocks in the sky, so I don't know why you'd be worrying about water flow. That's, that's pretty much standard in the Warhammer world, isn't it? I'm amazed there's not more skulls littering the ground. Okay, crossbows are in range to deal with those orc arrow boys, and deal with them they are. Not to mention the cannonballs. Taking out those Savage Orc biggins. Which I am all in favour of because those biggins are very nasty. 51 weapon strength, high melee attack. They they can do a lot of damage given half the chance. But uh, they are now falling back. Some of our crossbows are shooting into that house. I don't, because we... Our ammo is limited and is very precious. We want to use that to this, this. Wasting ammo to shoot into the roof of a house. Not good. Right, we're going to send our halberds in to attack the barricade. Bring that down. And then we need to go in and take this objective. Even if there are some orcs hanging around. So we're going to have to push our... Our oh, boys. I might be able to take this with... Oh, no, I won't be able to take it with you, is she? Because she's flying. She's a flying unit. So she can't actually... She can't actually take objectives now. Okay, that barricade is going down. Got some more Kara boys moving up to try and uh, support the barricade. But too little too late. And the cannonballs now raining down on their heads. But we do have some more Savage Orc biggins join the party. Fortunately, I've remembered to turn my crossbows back on and they're getting torn to shreds. Yep, that, that is the ground is littered with orc bodies now. Uh, but they are now rebuilding that barricade, which I'm not in favour of. So we need to bring you in to basically sit on that barricade and stop it from being finished. Because if they build that, if they finish building the barricade, then we'll have to smash it down again, which would be annoying. But if we go and sit on it, they can't finish it. It's like, you know, the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, where Arthur goes and lies in front of the bulldozer. It's basically the same thing. They can't finish the barricades if we're lying in it. So as long as, as, long as we don't move, we can just go straight through it, because it doesn't exist until it's fully completed. Good. So the Boar Boys sort of milling about there. So we're moving our halbards up first because if uh, those ball boys at the halbards they're going to have a bad time. They have an additional 16 anti-large. That, that adds uh, weapon strength and melee attack. So they charge in there. Don't get much... I mean, the, the, the ball boys have got reasonably good melee attack and reasonably good weapon strength, but they really need that charge bonus to do anything. It. Give him a prod. Give him a poke. They won't like it. Yeah, there they go. Ooh, that was a lot of that was a lot of ball boys dying. Uh, more savage orc biggins joining the party. Cannonballs raining down. Occasionally hitting our own our own men, but never mind. We've got a little bit of a surround here now. Again, savage orcs very good on the charge, but once that charge bonus wears off, if they don't get it, 
they really do struggle. Because they just don't have the armor. They do have some physical resistance, but that's that's about it. You know, that that's that's why you don't come to a battle naked, isn't it, lads? Hey? Right. We have secured this objective. We're now moving our units forward. We're gonna bring everyone up. Now, there's two ways you can win a siege. Obviously, you can kill everyone, or alternatively, you can take a position like this one. The enemy will try and retake it. And if you can just kill enough of them, then, you know, base that they'll all run away at that point. So we do have some more Savage Orc Biggins. Obviously, coming back from a previous route. Got the crossbows. Taking big chunks out of them. You charging in. Of course, you has magical attacks. Which means that she's actually going to do a lot of damage to these orcs. Because they don't have an armor. They they have physical resistance. Which doesn't work against magical attacks. And so, they, yep, they, they are taking... Yeah, there, there we go. Plus, you know, being hit by cannonballs doesn't really help. We've got some more orc units pouring in. And this is now kind of working as a magnet. So we're just starting to draw in orc units. As we wipe one out, they send more in. But it's all very piecemeal. There's no actual sort of like... There's no concerted efforts, no organized effort to retake, which is, you know, to be fair, the AI, but it kind of works for orcs because, you know, orcs are fucking dense. They just see a fight and they go charging towards it. They don't care. It's a bit, a bit of a blob going on over here. Some Savage Orc boar boys throwing themselves at our front line. The Jade Warriors holding nicely there. Do have their uh, Yang ability, so they get is it twelve additional mode effect? They're very tanky. Their stats are really good when they have that sort of proper positioning. We do have some orcs that actually race through our lines. I tried to get the Iron Hail Gunners into position, but the orcs just race through our lines. But this has actually worked out for detriment because now they're surrounded on all sides. And uh, they're getting to get absolutely chopped to pieces. They charge straight through us, and they're now being attacked on all flanks. So th this is not going very well for them. And in fact, yeah, there we go. Uh, they are losing decisively. I think they're trying to force their way through, but yeah, that that is not. Yeah, they're 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 fucked. They're out of here, and it looks like army loss has taken effect. They lost too many units, and their entire army breaks and runs. Nice, clean, precise. It's all you. Not not you. You. Not you know what I mean. Okay. The blue vipers are dead. But we are gonna have to deal with, with this little issue down here. Uh, but we do have the full what do we have? What okay, so if I knock that down. Then we should be good. Uh, do we have anything bad here? No, we're generally okay. So we could get the research rate. Income from trade. How, how much money are we making from trade? Just out of interest. What about, it's not very much, is it? It's not enough to change my life. So I am going to go for the uh, research rate, I think. We, how much money do we have? Ah, oh, a fair chunk of change. So we could get... I mean, what I want is a Terracotta Sentinels, because those are big, big burly boys. Uh, but I think to start off, it's probably best to get more cash at the moment, isn't it? Do we need defences down here? I mean, I feel like no, but then with with Kugath showing up right down there, I'm, I'm kind of thinking maybe y yes. Definitely. And of course more pots, because uh, pots make the world go round. Looming lanterns. Oh. But. Fast hand. Well, I do love Mason fast hand. You know what? Let's go fast hands. I think the problem. I, like, I, I know that um, Zhao Ming is a bit more melee orientated. The problem is, I think Cathay's quite a ranged army in general. So I think Meow Meow is probably the better option. Because um, it kind of goes to their strengths. So, mind you, Zhao Ming obviously going to make your front line a little bit more tanky. So there is that. But. 
I do think that the the fact that you have that sort of like radius you have to be, so your missile units need to be close to your melee units, means you can't really send your melee units off to like engage stuff far. It, it, it doesn't really work like that, does it? Talons of... Oh, you can summon ancestral warriors. I mean, that is pretty fucking legit. I'm not going to lie. You do get a vortex spell as well. Um, you know what? Let's get a little summon. A little summon. Why not? So, right, we've got we've got a fed. What we need to do is confederate these boys now. But, uh, wow, there's some stuff going on over here. What the fuck is... Honestly, you sort out the front of Cathay. You turn your back for a second and it's complete... Just pandemonium back here. There's some rebels. There's zinch rebels. There's orcs. There's more zinch. It, oh, meow, meow. God damn it, meow, meow. Yeah, okay, good. Right, uh, wh oh, wait, when's the research? To t right, what research did I get? I got that one. Uh, what do we have? I was knocking down that, wasn't I? Which is... Wait, what am I? I'm researching a white one, aren't I? I am researching a white one, so I want a black one. That is a white one. So what we could actually... Ah, oh, you know what? I'm going to knock it down. I stand ready. Yeah, you do. You do, he can. You do, you're doing great standing, by the way. Just fantastic standing. I think I'm going to put you in this army. I don't know what I'm going to get rid of, though. Maybe one of the Jade Warriors? Maybe do that? Oh, I, you know what? You've, you, you're going to get Garrison, because you have done so well, little little town. Little Town has done just fantastic work in not dying. I'm, I'm amazed. I haven't touched it. Normally, that would mean that that town is doomed, but it has been clinging on for dear life. Military access. You are at war with Goldtooth. Nope. Oh no, no. We're gonna, we're gonna. Oh, hello. Take the fight. Oh no, we do not want to fight that. We will take the long way. Okay, but in one turn we get. A white one, and then we're all good. Fine. Right, let's go and deal with Kugath down here. I don't think they'll have... In fact, it looks like they don't have anything. So, we will go deal with that. You are fine. We have a little army heading this way. Will you try and batter your way through, or what? Maybe if we can get if we can get the upkeep reduction for the army, because that's like sixty-five percent, isn't it? Sixty-five percent. So you could get a, you could get, you know you could really garrison that with a fairly fairly good pile of chunky boys. Let's upgrade the capital. You are fine. You are fine. You are getting some walls all up in here. I keep seeing that and I keep thinking about it, but I keep losing settlement. Right, we're going to save two... Wait, why can't you build that? Oh, because you're not level two yet. Right, you, you, you will do. You, you'll get it. Don't worry. Oh, I could get the garrison. Don't really need it. Uh, growth, not the worst thing to have. And let's get walls down here, just because I don't... I do not trust... I do not trust Zinch. I don't trust him. Which is a good thing. I am open to assisting your ends. I... We, we're not. We're not. We do not, we do not want a defensive alliance with you. Because you do not like Gold Tooth, and we need Gold Tooth. Austin's dead. That's good, maybe. The Celestial. Let's bop we you. Uh, yep, they take the money. They shall fight for us. Uh, I don't really want to be. At, I mean, hopefully, Meow Meow will deal with that. We've got a Zinch Force in the midst of Cathay, which needs to be dealt with. Uh, right. The corruption is dropping. 
Maybe, I mean, we've got this. Maybe more, less corruption would be good, because that means we can then... Because at the moment, we're not getting any growth. I should have gone for the... <sighs> should have gone for that to start off with, really, shouldn't I? Construct... Okay, let's get Yang Kill and Moon Woods. The Tomb of Furion. What, wait, what was that? Something about Daddy being pleased? Dragon Emperor is pleased, an army of chaos threatened the goat that's been defeated. Okay, well as long as he's as long as he's chipper. That still ruins. You've got okay, you've got that. You had an army there to start off with, but I don't think you've got that one there, so I'm sure that will be absolutely fine, and that's that wall won't immediately collapse. So this is this is all good. Nothing to worry about. I kind of want to do that, but I don't know if it's actually worth the effort. Uh, making you more tanky could be a good option. We could get this one. What level are you? 34. I mean, we could maybe get the blue line. I, I could maybe do this. Should we do this? Because we could get metal we could get metal shifting strength of yang and then evasion like dragon's breath and glittering robe i'm not too worried about boon to my experiments. outpost i don't care about i've only built the one in meow meows because it might stop her from dying glory, but i'm not i'm not that invested to be honest you're fine would, would she would she though because you're not doing very well, Meow Meow. You are kind of... Oh, fuck. I forgot to move for you. Bollocks. Never mind. We'll, we'll take that settlement out. That's fine. And then we can move you back over to the west, I think. Just to keep an eye... Just to keep an eye out for Zinch attacks. Is there a little army there now? Uh... Feeding time, it would give me more relations with gold too, so yep. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep. Oh, you have built a little army. Oh yeah, baby, my hands are gonna be all over you. We will bring order. And let's raise it. Just uh just remove that little threat, I think. Okay, immortality for you. It befits my high station. It does. Immortality. Holy shit, yeah. Great. Okay, I want to take that at some point, but we'll worry about that in a bit. We need to deal so. with this bullshit. This so we're going to meander in this direction. Now this is Sanchi, so we could take this. So we could take this province, and I'm kind of tempted to do that. We actually have a fair chunk of change. So what I could do is we could get a new lord. Now, we're currently perfectly balanced, which is annoying. But if we get a new lord, we can recruit some units and stick them in Snake Gate to hold the line there. And I think that's probably a, a sensible option, seeing as there's not much of a garrison. Uh, tactician is kind of meh. What about Lord Magistrate? Solid. Martial artist, enlightens. Uh, we could go solids. What are we? Hang on. What are we researching at the moment? What are we researching? We are researching a white one. So if we get, oh, I don't really want you. You are fine. Construction. I mean, that might actually be a reasonably good choice. It's only minus 10%, but... It's only 10%, but... We're going to do it. And 
We're just going to recruit a shit ton of archers. And then we're going to garrison Snake Gate just so we can hold the line a bit while Xiao Ming is dealing with these rascally, rascally zinch peeps. Watch rascals they are. I'm going to actually save my money. I'm going to save my pennies because I need to recruit more, more peasanty people. I think peasanty people should be fine. I am open to assisting your ends. You want minute? Nope. I wish there was a way you could just like tick a faction to say I do not want to hear from you ever. I have no interest in hearing from you ever. Right, we're we're three. But get, right, okay. Control is fine. Let us go for uh, the Great Bastion. So it's currently at plus five. Which is... So could we have a... Like, I, I guess you could negate some of... Because... Oh, hello. That was a bit quicker than I thought Did it I? would be. The dragon blooded. We must be tireless. Okay, if we run over here... Celestial ancestors. Then you know nothing. That that sure. Hello. Stop that. There's a Ooh. fair few of you. Oh, have you? Oh, you've got it under siege. Have you got it under siege? Have you? Or have you just attacked it? Did you just sack it? You just sacked it. All right. Well, I guess I'll take it then. Thank you. If I switch this round to do I oh do I have to, oh no I can do that there we go right switch that round uh, what I need to do is get you spread the emperor's words yep yeah, that's what we're doing it's not, it's not madness it's fine what how many units you got oh you got 19 did we lose someone or was like did I intend that I might have intended it I might have intended it I just don't know all right, we need to get you back over here to help defend the gates, which is under attack now. This is probably fine. Okay, they've just got a shit ton of orcs. That That is... I mean, it's not ideal. It's not ideal, but it we can work with that. Like, killing, killing a horde of orcs should be... No big, no big problem. Hello, lizard people. I want to be your friends. Yeah. I wonder if we can get, oh, if we can get lizard allies. Okay, Snake Gate is under, si hello. That was a mistake. Ah. Uh, uh, huh. Okay, might have to abandon this because apparently suddenly everything's kicking off as per fucking usual. Why the fuck are you back? All right. Least, oh, we got a Sky Titan relic. Did we? Is that the one we lost? Is that the one we lost? Don't know. Oh, that's a lot of flamers. I am not in favour of that. Okay, I don't actually think you will take much attrition. Ancestors. Can you actually recruit units at the moment? Fire and metal shall save us all. Because you're under siege, but if you get, I'm um, I'm sorry, you've got a strange hunger. Bit weird. Ye who? Oh, this guy. Um, okay, let's make you sell stuff better. And then soon as you finished, we can send Gunho the hypercapitalist to where's this? Erengrad. Fuck it, yeah, why not? I wonder if we can get you. I, I would really like to give you, get you on side. Uh, 
Uh, let's go down aggression. Exciting. If we can get you on sides, then I could... Because you're not military... At, I could get some lizard boys in my army. I would love lizard boys in my army. Cathay with lizard boys. Oh. Oh. The very thoughts. The very thoughts. So, what... Hang on. What... Well, all right, we need some we need some whiteies, don't we? We need some whiteies. So let's get some defences here because just to be on the safe side, and so we can get a little bit more money there. This is good. God, what? Like, why did this beaky boy show up? We need to get you over to the to the bastion to help the bastion while Zhao Ming can, can go and do other things, because otherwise we're just going to be under constant attack. So Yu is going to have to defend the Bastion. I mean, we, we do have a little army growing, which should be fine. We're not taking much attrition damage. But these Skyveners, skiv Scriveners? More like dickheads. You have no power over me. Okay, you've run away, which is... Totally sensible. That was a mistake, maggot. No tits. Okay, this army's now quite... Power in the blood. ...is pretty good. I don't think we really have to worry about... ...being shielded. Of course, the tech doesn't actually affect the unshielded ones, does it? For some reason. I mean, it's not a huge problem. If we get a couple of those lads. Loyalty, efficiency, and harmony. Basically, we're just gonna fill up with missile units because that makes life really hard. Campaign movement range for Yang armies, lovely. A new destiny. It makes it a lot harder for for Doobie Doo. Whatever, whatever I was thinking. That train of thought just just disappeared, like the morning mist. Where did that go? Let's get you. Let's do something like that. Right. The dragon blooded. Yes. Okay. I think the bastion should be fine, but we'll bring you. I mean, we, I don't think we need you down here. Hello, hello, rascally rebels. The fuck did you come from? Where the f no, seriously, where the fuck did you come from? You've got settlement up here, but why... Oh. We've got several settlements there. How the fuck have you got an empire? What the hell is going on? Yourself useful to the Gold Goldtooth, what... What is... Mate, mate, what is going on, mate? What? Your strength rank two. Why the... Why, what? Is this cinch bollocks? It must be, but how is it? What? What? Alright, well, you's got another problem then, I guess. Get out of the, my fuck, mind. the fuck is that? What the hell is going on? Uh-oh. That, like, that looks like a Kairos to me. Hello, Military Alliance. No. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, well, look, you're going to run away, aren't you? You're going to, like, just book it. I don't really want to give you those, but it is just a unit of peasant archers, so, all right. Oh, you haven't run away. Good. That's fine. Just stay there so I can kick the shit out of you. Come over here. Come here, bird brain. Do you even have a weapon? I disagree. Yeah, the last thing I wanted is him recruiting... Because he already had a great unclean one in his army. The last thing I wanted is him meandering around with more shit like that. Okay, that's not actually Kairos, is it? No. For some reason you've taken damage? Maybe you got attacked by Miao Ying. Doesn't look like she has any armies anymore. Trusted allies. What 
What information do you bring? Your strength rank four. You've got no Miao Ying. You've got no armies, and your confederation is currently my baseline evaluation is minus ninety five. Like why? Descended from celestial glory. Okay, I'm going to the scamper over here. Destiny. We're going to lay a little ambush. See if we can catch you. But where, what, why, what, uh, how, how this has happened, I genuinely don't know. You're on my good side until you are not. Could I get a defensive alliance with you? Yes. So let's get a defensive alliance and see what is going on over here. So it looks like you're pushing Kugath back, which is great. I thought I said hissing piss camp. I was like, well, that's... I would certainly seek medical attention if that were the case. I'll definitely get that looked at. Ranged? I guess getting missile... I mean, mm, maybe. Okay, let's get strength of Yang. An extension of my celestial will. Let's do that one. I guess you could boost ink. There's nothing else you can really do. I mean, I could get glittering, I guess glittering robe. It's not a spell I'm going to use that often, but uh, that is fine. You've got all of those. I could spread control. Range resistance for a big old compassy thing is probably not, not the worst. Not the worst option. Celestial ancestors. Ruler of the sky roll. If I bring you over here, can you replenish? Yes, you can. Perfect. Right, we need to deal with that. I'm a little bit concerned about Meow Meow now, because it looks like she's lost all of her... She's lost all... And she doesn't want to confederate. She's like dead dead set against it. It's not a big problem, because, you know, victory... Victory mission, victory objective-wise, we just... I need a, I mean, a military alliance, with, and I need to build the Great Embassy, which I think is... Here? The Great Embassy. So we just need the Great Embassy, really. And a military alliance. And then Bishwash Bash, all sorted. I feel like maybe those victory obje objectives are a little bit on the easy side. Maybe, like, you need to hold the Bastion as well. Like, military alliance, or you hold the Bastion. And all of the Cathay, all the provinces in Cathay belong to Cathay. Because Cathay are very sort of, like, insular, aren't they? They're very sort of like, protective. So it makes sense that if you just held all of the provinces in Cathay, that would be a victory condition. I think so. So, should we go for the victory conditions as they stand, which is to just do this, which is fine, or should should we maybe do some other victory conditions? Like, holding the Bastion, taking the whole of Cathay. I think that would make sense, wouldn't it? Like, holding the whole of Cathay, holding the Bastions with Military Alliance, um, having the Greasers thing, that seems fine, and the, the Embassy, that seems fine, but maybe just like holding the rest of Cathay and holding the Bastion with a Military Alliance, that kind of... I think, you, are you guys? You Welcome. So we don't actually have a... Do we have a... No, we don't. Can we get one? Are we already in a military... Why can't I get a Military Alliance with you? Let us learn from each other's methods. That's weird. I don't... Do I... Do I already? Oh, no, I do. No. That's the Western... Pro I'm the Western province, right? Yes. So... Do, wait, what? So I've got one with the J Custodians. I've got a military alliance with the Northern provinces. I've got a defensive alliance with the J Custodians and Goldtooth. So why can't I get a... Together we shall maintain order and balance. In I, d I don't know. Well, good. I'm fairly sure I don't have a military alliance with them, but that's weird that I can't see unless they're like a vassal or something. Would they're not a vassal, are they? No. Analyzing some war what scenarios? the fuck? That's weird. Genuinely a little bit confused about that. Okay, well, I guess I won't worry about that. So the poll for next time is, do do we just go for the victory conditions as they stand, or do we go for 
something a little bit more all-encompassing. I'll wait until next time. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.